Hello learners, in this lecture we will study the measures of dispersion. The phrase measure of dispersion means the various possible methods of measuring the dispersions or deviations of the different values from a designated value of a series which may be average or any other extreme value. Methods of studying dispersion, range, interquartile range and quartile deviation, mean deviation or average deviation, standard deviation, Lorentz curved method. The first two called distance measures or positional me measures. Range. Range is defined as the difference between the two extreme values of a series. Thus, absolute range equals to largest value minus smallest value or R is equals to L minus S. And the coefficient of range or coefficient of range equals to L minus S upon L plus S where L is equals to largest value of a series, S equals to smallest value of a series. Range tells us the interval within which all items of a series lie, the average of two sets of data being the same, the distribution with less range has less dispersion, Frequencies have no role in determining the value of range, so ignore them both in discrete as well as continuous series. Interquartile range is defined as the difference between the two extreme quartiles of a series. Thus, absolute IQR equals to Q3 minus Q1 and coefficient of IQR is equals to Q3 minus Q1 upon Q3 plus Q1, where Q3 is the upper quartile of a series and Q1 is the lower quartile of a series. Mean deviation may be defined as the arithmetic average of the deviations of items of a series taken from its central value ignoring the plus and minus signs. The central value may be mean, median or mode. The signs are disregarded as some of the deviations from arithmetic mean is always zero. It is also known as first moment of dispersion. The mean deviation can be calculated in both absolute and relative manners. MD is equals to submission x minus x dash upon n that is summation of d upon n where mode d is the modulus or absolute value of deviation from mean or median or mode ignoring signs md is the mean deviation and n is the number of items or observations of series standard deviation the concept of standard deviation was introduced by carl pearson in 1823 standard deviation may be defined as the positive square root of the arithmetic average of the squares of deviations of the given values taken from the arithmetic average of a series. It is denoted by the geek letter called sigma. Sigma equals to under root summation of x minus x bar square upon n. Coefficient of a standard deviation is expressed as the ratio of absolute standard deviation to the arithmetic average of the series. Coefficient of standard deviation equals to standard deviation upon mean. Coefficient sigma equals to sigma upon x bar it is a relative measure which is very useful in comparing the consistency of two or more series if the value of coefficient is less a series is more consistent and vice versa so in this lecture we have covered measuring of dispersion see you in the next lecture thank you